Hey guys, it looks like Zoe is dreaming something awful. <sighs> so, two days ago, we just fucked everything up. We just... Oh, why did I sleep on the couch? The hell? Why would there be a dream machine? We hate them. Oh no, I think she did say she had one. This is some nice little cinematography. Hmm. Okay, journal update? Thursday really already? Wait, what, next Thursday? I've been going over things in my head for a week. Did I do the right thing, giving the data to Sully in the hand? They're still working on the story, but it should be ready any day now. Yeah, they've been doing a ton of fact checking and background information. They know this is going to be huge once it's published. So I guess I did the right thing. But yeah, no, I'm not sure. Also, look at all this therapy that I just totally didn't ignored. Well then. Too late to do that now. Things Look at the journey. Too well the last time I connected to a dreamer. I want to see what happens. Screw it. Mira, do you have a second? Mm. Depends. Are you done? I need those bots to go out tomorrow. Almost done. I, I was wondering if I could leave a teensy bit early today. Be kind. Rewind. Almost? Mostly. I'm mostly done. Can you experience, Petal? What's my answer to a question like that? <laughs> uh, one filled with expletives. But it's really important that I... Of course it's fucking important. It's always important. Is never not important. You wouldn't be asking if it wasn't important, would you, Kutria? So what's so important that you feel it takes precedence over the work I pay you to do? I have an appointment with the editor of The Hand. They're doing a story and... And he can't do this story without you. Even though he's a professional reporter and you're a... a what are you again? You tell me. Most of the time I'm running errands. I should be programming. Should is a big word. I should be making a million yuan. I should not be forced to run my operations out of a murder choding garage. And you should be grateful you have a job that pays a decent salary. I am. Decent? A salary. Go on, get out of here before I change my mind and make you work overtime. <laughs> Just be here extra early tomorrow to, I don't know, what do you hate doing the most? Sitting at my terminal learning more about neural programming. I really, really hate that. Mopping floors. That's <laughs> it. You'll come extra early to mop the fucking floors. All right? <sighs> yes. Fine. Sure. Oh. Well, obviously, we're going to the hand because we are off the political campaign. Rudy is sad. He can fuck off, though. I am not a fan of people doing backdoor deals like that. Not in real life and surely not in my fiction. This game is interesting though. Sometimes I work like purely on instinct and just do stuff. I'm not available at the moment. For any questions pertaining to the Lea Uminska campaign, please contact the Unity Party directly as I'm no longer employed by the campaign. Ooh. So we're still under lock and key. Not as bad though. Oh, wait, never mind. 
I see some new people getting arrested over in the corner. You look like you could need some directions, miss. Oh god. I don't like you. Leave me alone, guys. What do you mean you won't let me in? You will let me in. This is my office. Step back, citizen, or I will be forced to I shoot- I will not step back, you piss lick. You'll have to shoot me where I stand before I- Sully? What's going on? Christ on the derby, Zoe. You shouldn't be here. We have an appointment. Ah, kasha, of course. I'm such a salaka. I should have messaged you as soon as I- Our offices were attacked last night by masked goons. They trashed everything, our screens, our furniture, everything. When I called in this morning, these things show up. Battle suits, syndicate agents. They take our equipment away, interrogate my employees. And now they refuse to let me back in my own fucking office! What? Why? They Claiming know. We're under investigation. Us! We're the victims here! You should so just. What about. But the story. We can't publish anything right now. They've confiscated our data banks and terminals, cut our wire access. Even my iris is displaying an error message. They have been exceptionally thorough. But the data is safe. Our research is safe. Okay. We've learned our lessons. We keep everything on offshore servers in Iceland. No amount of court orders, corporate threats, or military action can get to that data. Okay. But for the time being, that's also where it stays. Great. If we try to access it remotely, they'll intercept our connection. If we try to publish it, they'll stick us in the gulag. Is that what this is all about? What else could it be? We were this close to revealing a connection between the I clamp down, several of the political parties, and the Wati controlled syndicate. So what's gonna happen? Right now, nothing. We sit tight, let them believe they've silenced us. And then we find a way to publish. Your man, uh, Reza. Caught the first fact tracks north this morning, carrying three very expensive and very, very secure hollow mems. He'll retrieve our backups and then we'll take it from there. Reza did what? He didn't tell me. How did he get out? He got out by not telling anyone he was getting out. He disabled his iris, used a disposable identity, got smuggled across the river in an empty container. Wow. He'll try and get in touch as soon as he's made it safely to Iceland, but he will need to be careful. Bet you've got them monitoring every channel of communication. I guess he's not there yet. Oh shit, Sully, I feel responsible. You just handed us the story of the year. The fact that they'll go to such lengths to silence us is a good thing. But you do need to watch your back, Zoe. There's every chance what Cop's keeping an eye on you as well. Definitely. The is their doing, behind the cover of the syndicate. They want people off the streets into dream time. For whatever reasons. Which is why they're buying political power. Exactly. Yeah. We have proof that both Unity and the European Dawn are in their pockets. Whoever wins the election will be under Wati's thumb. It Pretty seems much. The only party that isn't being run by the corporations is Manifesto. It's not like they're going to win the election. If we are able to publish our story before the election, who knows? Never underestimate the collective anger of the masses. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm getting a call. Is it Reza? No. Nella. Why would she be calling? One moment. Is this a bad time? No, it's fine. What's up, Nella? I need to see you. Can we meet in the shuk? No problem. I'll be there in a minute. Thanks, Zozo. Where is oh, that? I, I need to run. Can we talk later? You bet. I'm gonna do my best to make life difficult for these bastards. But I'll call you. That's wild. I knew it had to be. Mm. They shouldn't have sat on it for a week. I mean, it's good they still have their original. It would really help to have an overview of all those ventilation taps. It would really help to have an overview. Our apartment is off Sonnen's Reza's office. The Mira's shop is located in the bricks. It was a pleasure serving you this fine day. What is the shuck? I'm 
here to give you that. It would really help to have an overview of all those vent. Our apartment at Rezazov the Uminska. Mira's shop is located in the bricks. And what you it would really help to have an overview of all those ventilation towers or whatever they are. Show me Prista Vista, please. The Pamatnik collapse. Planning on a trip down the river? You got it, pal girl. Pro pass docks coming right up. Anytime you need a rootin' tootin' six barrel shootin' crow cowboy to give you directions to anywhere in Pro Pass, you just call on the crow boy. Where is the shuck? Okay, so that's where Unity was, and that's locked down. Stuff. Stuff and things. Oh. Nella? Zozo. Thanks for coming. Are you okay? I just need a favor. I need you to hold on to this for me. What is it? Something personal. Will you keep it safe? Sure, sure, but why? What's going on? I don't want it to get lost, or... Why would it? Nella, you're making me worried. Are you involved in something? Don't worry about it, Zozo. Just keep that safe for a little while. I'll get in touch soon. Thanks for coming so quickly. I have to run. But uh, I don't... I really have to go. There's something I need to... to do. Bye, Zoe. Something's going on. She looked freaked out. Maybe I should follow and make sure she's okay. I support this. Cannot run. That booty, though. <laughs> Why don't I ever look at Kian's butt? I will do that next time. I honestly didn't expect to come back to her after the big, you know, story drop, so. So it's interesting to see what's going on here in the city. That is a giant mouth. Stay safe. Stay inside. Stay in touch with your body dream machines. The streets are dangerous. Avoid the streets. Crowds are unsafe. Avoid crowds. What in the world is she doing? Oh my god. What? That was a cool frame, but what? Did she just blow herself up? Come on, tell me something. Not again! Oh, Christ. Oh, no. Are we really stuck in a coma again? <sighs> All right, let's look at our questions. With a man's life at stake and the fate of the resistance in the balance, I took the time needed to identify the right person. I did get him! The fate of the collaborator will have consequences in the future. Your performance will affect your relationship with the rebels. So we found him. He was the right guy. I didn't... Okay, that's good to know. I was worried. Blue Lee caught the arrow before it struck. He could have let the arrow kill me and no one would have blamed him. Why did he save my life? 
Oh, so I could have grabbed it myself? I was having too much trouble trying to figure out things. I could not let Blue Knee murder the woman in front of everyone. Her betrayal was my responsibility, but now he has more reasons to hate me. Your decision will affect your future relationships with both Liko and the other rebels. The consequences will be seen, heard, and felt in the next book. Zoe Maya Castillo. Until I recall what happened before the coma, I won't be able to move on. It won't be easy, but it'll work hard to remember. By now you've realized how important your memories are. They will continue to haunt you in the next book. This path will, become an, will come to an inevitable conclusion. 91% of people chose to remember. The data was too important to leave in one person. I had to take it to the hand. 78% of people did this. There are more consequences to come. Kian Alvain. Anna ambushed me, but I couldn't simply reject her. Hey, she's cute. I like her red hair. I don't care. Hope she's not a bad person. How do you justify torture? Was the information worth breaking the oath I've made to myself and others? Damn. Listen, y'all have to be okay, but he deserved it. We let him live, and we should have chopped his dick off. Though the officer deserved death, he will be worth more to us alive, but Liko may never forgive me for my choice. We told the girl to run away. I mean, she's still got life-altering trauma, but it's a good time. Once again, another superb chapter from Red Thread Games. I love this one better than I love the first one. Uh, even though I got a little confused with some of the stuff, and there are some, some minor things that could uh, make a game difficult to play at times, uh, like that random bug at the end where the little kid disappeared you know that doesn't really change how i feel about the game so what i have to restart a section and come right back to something whatever um for me it's it's completely worth it this is amazing and wonderful um i know that you can buy a dreamfall chapters season pass for 30 dollars. so essentially you're getting each game for 10 bucks definitely not bad um, you can pre-order it for Windows Mac and Linux uh, DRM free plus a Steam K I like to buy games that are DRM free because I just do I, I hate the cloud um, I think there's also a special edition season patch which comes with the soundtrack which is phenomenal which we're listening to right now and the art books and wallpapers avatars um, I think there's even like a book like an ebook that comes with it, so that's pretty cool. You get a whole lot for five bucks. Um, like I said, I love this. I loved some of the writing. Um, I, I just think it was a, a, a great game. Uh, if three is better than two, then this will be possibly one of my most favorite episodic gaming things. I don't think I... I didn't think I would find a game that... I liked more than uh, Telltale's Walking Dead, but this is definitely trying to get into the running. It, it's definitely gonna end up being a top five. I don't know how the future and this weird alternate reality are gonna come together, but I guess we'll just have to see. And that's all I can say. So if you like it, you can get it on Steve. You can get it on uh, Red Thread's website. It's a beautiful game. It's definitely got some emotional stuff. Uh, the little quirks don't uh, kill it for me. I've heard it's coming to PlayStation 4 for people. It'll probably look pretty awesome there. Um, but yeah. Like you, know. you know, so I'm really interested in seeing Arcadia, this parallel world Perhaps that's you know. part of magic, and and there's this huge Nazi-like uh, push to destroy an entire population of people. And uh, I'm really interested in learning more about the the Guardian. 
who she saw in her dream who's you know and the sleeping person not sure if that was a boy or a girl whose dreams choose you know the future for these people uh, I think the plot point about the people who are addicted to dreaming is really really into it's almost it almost ties a little into substance abuse or even like the internet and how people use anything they can to escape and uh, I think in that instance I can understand it but obviously any sort of addiction but especially an addiction to these dream machines is deathly I mean this is the ability to you'll lose not just yourself but your life uh, I'm not sure what's gonna happen I don't know if Zoe's in a coma again thanks to Nella that's why I stopped running but the game made me catch up to her cuz I was like whoa 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 I'm not gonna be here when you blow shit up also what did she have us holding what was in that little box will I still have it when I come back um, we know Kian Elvain is safe with the rebels for now at least but uh just so much going on these are all the kickstarter backers uh this is another great time that you know there's been a lot of negativity with kickstarter but this is the the positive stuff when it's really good and it's great it makes something amazing this you know red thread didn't have to give it to a publisher or allow another group of people who aren't game makers to Put their opinion into the game they could just make something that was pure and wonderful without any you know undue pressure from suits we'll call them suits even though that's sometimes a negative you know sometimes these publishers are good for a company but sometimes they're really bad it's been a lot of a uh, talk about some other triple-a companies in this addiction to profit and uh, maximizing profit which is what you do when you run a business but it's, it's kind of like any other medium like writing or, or music like you do dilute the purity of the art form when you make it all about the money you know we have all these musicians right now who are you know barely one hit wonders if that and and they really make pretty craptastic music that we're not going to remember in the next like 10 years they're not the greats they're not making it for the purity of the art form so i personally appreciate kickstarter and 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 any sort of crowdfunding like patreon and things like that that allow people to uh contribute to things that are great and yeah occasionally uh games don't come through and that's the risk you make when you, you buy into anything, but when it's something as good as Dreamfall Chapters, it's worth it a hundred times over. But uh, I think I'm done. I've talked enough for the day. I'm going to uh, let the credits play out and tell you guys to like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. I had such a great time. I hope you had a great time too. And uh, I will see you on whatever new series I get myself tangled up in uh, once I am moved into my new apartment. <laughs> and uh, see you guys later. Bye.
relationship that doesn't end in a breakup ends in death. Everything you falls apart. Good. Yeah, that's your world. Right. Right. And I know I can be a bit of a troll. Don't know where we're going. Don't just say you love me, show me. I got you, but I'm alone. 